I don't come here to be told what to do by you. Okay. Listen to what your colleagues are telling you. Listen you. to me. No. Right, so, so why should it, I listen to Where you? does it say operations director? Because I don't believe is, you. Is, is it I'm not saying. Okay, good. Yeah, that's that, mate, yeah. Where are you from around here? No, Leicester. Leicester, you live around here? No, Leicester. You've been all the way from Leicester? Not on this, oh. yeah. <laughs> Just filming. Just making a video. Oh, have a good one, Mark. Take care, mate. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so, welcome back to the channel, guys. Today we're here in Wensbury, taking a look at the Trade Centre UK, the UK's cheapest cars. Now that's a big claim. The UK's cheapest cars, five star rating on Trustpilot, and you can drive away in one hour. Quite decent, that is. So once you've found your vehicle, I presume there's quite a lot on the forecourt. They'll get all the paperwork done and get you on the road within an hour. Brilliant. And what's this sign say? All day, every day, nine till nine, opening times. We've also got uh, a banner here, over 100,000 customers can't be wrong. Photo taken from the same spot high up somewhere. Wonder where that was taken. So they have a transporter just entering sight at the moment. Can can. Can can dot com car finance. We've got the booking in office or gatehouse, shall we call it a gatehouse, whatever. And then of course loads and loads of drivers that are gonna look like that. High vis little badge. So we'll have a little look around this place and see what we can see. So once again, Monday to Friday, nine till nine, or Saturday and Sunday, nine till six. Stacks and stacks of signage. But the pedestrian gate seems to be closed, so. A pedestrian's welcome in here. You're welcome to just walk in on foot. Yeah. Yeah. Is this just like um, an internet buy-in place, and then you collect it, or can you wander around and have a look? Wander around and have a view. The showrooms there. Yeah. Oh, brilliant. Okay, I can do some filming and that. Yeah. Um, I'm not sure about that. You'd have to ask the manager, management first. Right. Because I'm filming as I go on. You see. Do you want to check or? Um, if you just go in. Because I never turn it off, you see. Yeah, you just walk down there, and basically you'll see the entrance down the bottom. And if you just go and ask permission first, and so what's up. Yeah, you see, I'll already be filming by the time I get there. Do you get that? Yeah. The body cam. Yeah, because I'm with the GD, GDPR and all that kind of stuff, so I'm. A bit, if I'm I not, just stay but, outside then, maybe, and don't go near any personal data that I might see on the desks. Because I'll tell you what, I'll tell you a bit more, now you're um in and are in, I go and find interesting places yeah. in the UK. Yeah. I make a little 20 minute video of yeah. it and I take the drone over. Yeah. Just to get an aerial shot and yeah. I put it on YouTube. Yeah. So that's it. Yeah, I don't, I don't think we could, I don't think they'd be down for it to be quite honest. If you was just there for a, you know, a call. Yeah. Well, I, I'm sort of, you, you class yourself as the, what, what did you say, the, the largest? The cheap, sorry, the cheapest in the probably, UK. Probably. Probably. Oh, is that what it says? Probably. What's probably. it say? Oh, probably the UK's cheapest cars. Yeah. Oh, do they have to put the word probably in there, do they? Right. Because they don't want to make a false claim. Well, who, who would? Just advertising, isn't it? Yeah. But the fact they're making that bold statement and you've got five stars on Trustpilot, yeah. or has that gone down now? That's probably gone down. <laughs> Another false claim. <laughs> but it just I catches my that. eye. All, all yeah. the banners catch my yeah. eye. So I am going to make a video, I am going to take the drone over. I don't want to go anywhere where I shouldn't. Right, OK, yeah, that's all you mean. So your security, it's your job to say allowed or not allowed. Again, it's a blue area because I don't work for this company directly. Right. You know what I mean? But, you're outsourced, you know, are you? Yeah, you're outsourced, so 
you know, but I mean, if they want a bit of free publicity, then... It's there, isn't it? But yeah. if they object to it, I'll just carry on the video from outside, you see. Yeah. So what do you reckon? Shall I'll... I have a little wander around and wait wait I'll... for them to object? I'd I'd go and ask. I would sincerely go and ask. Okay. And just All right. don't tell them you've got it running. Don't tell them. <laughs> don't tell them. <laughs> oh, I told you, though, did I? Yeah. What's your job, then, just to book these lot in? Yeah, yeah. Yeah. So, okay. just stop it, like... Okay, mate. Uh, you know, just basically, uh, you're going to have a word with the management, so, you know, and then uh, you get the A and A off them. Yeah, sound, mate. Thank you. So there's no marked footways for a place that encourages pedestrians in. So another banner, interesting one. 9.4 out of 10 on Trustpilot. Well, it only goes up to five. Then over in the corner there, we have sellyourcartoday.com. So you can come and sell your car in that corner and buy another one and drive it away in an hour. <laughs> Check out our Trustpilot where our customers have rated as 9.4 out of 10. Let's check that. So yeah, 4.4. You can only get a maximum of five. So I'm not sure where they're getting the 9.4 out of 10 from. Hmm. Security said, just let you know, I'm just doing some filming. So if you see me, I'm gonna take the drone over just to get an aerial shot, a bit like what you got there. All right, and then just put it on YouTube. All right, thanks. That's a nice board. Looks like it's backlit. Yeah, canvas, backlit. That's a good idea. Stands out. I wonder if we'll be able to find where that photo was taken. Always got a blue gate in the background there, look. There must be some sort of balcony up high to get that angle. So we're looking for the blue gate and somewhere up high. <laughs> Do you know where they take the photos of the people um, collecting the car? And it looks like it's taken from above. On, um, you've got loads of photos there of it. Oh yeah. Canvas in there. Yeah, a lot of them are from different sites, sites in Wales when we first opened. Oh. Things like that. So it wasn't here? No, I don't right. think it was. Right, okay. I've mate. never seen them do that. I've been here three or four years. Right, got you. Okay, mate. Oh, right. Yeah. Are these cars for sale? These ones on the no, front? No, this is a customer car park. Right. Step through there, we'll do the other. Right, we'll okay, see. mate. Probably the UK's cheapest cars. Nice little area where you do the deal. In there. Massive collage at the top of all the staff. And in there, very nice. Good morning. Oh, wow. Hello. I'm like the first customer of the day. How are you today? Yeah, I'm okay. Um, I'm not a customer, I'm just making a video. So I'm just gonna have a look around. Okay. Well. Feel free. Thank you. Are you making a video for? For YouTube. For YouTube? Yeah. Right. Thank you, mate. Um, do you know over there where you've got uh, lots of photos looking down at the customer taking the car away? Yeah. And um, where was that taken? Where was the photo taken? I don't know. Like this one, look. I'll show you. Where's yeah, but I don't know. Are you? It's there, look. Someone knows you. Let me show you. Look, it's the same spot, but different photos. You see? So, which which location was the photo taken? I don't know because things might have changed, and this is since they opened, and I'm would your slightly colleagues, new here. Would your colleagues know the answer? Do you know where those pictures are taken? Yeah, Ask him. <laughs> Do you know where those pictures? have been taken? No, probably it was taken a long time ago. Probably outside. Probably outside yeah, outside which spot? I'm not sure to be honest. Yeah, it might be... 
It looks like it's the uh, front of the trade center, isn't it? One there's a blue, be. there's a blue gate in the background on every single photo. I just yeah. want to know where it was taken, whereabouts. Should from close. Yeah, they're close to this one. Yeah. <clears throat> Must be a balcony up high where somebody's there with a camera looking down. Yeah. Because it, it wasn't with a drone, was it? No, definitely not. Because you're not going to take a drone up every time. Yeah, that's a that's a blue gate. Yeah, yeah you're right. Because all the all this fence is <clears throat> grey. Different colour, yeah. And it's it's a marked car park where you yeah. park sideways. You know, it's not one of where you go in. Yeah. You must be at the very front, maybe. <laughs> no, I've looked. No, he looked at there. No. Because can we get right round the back to find it? I can walk around and find it myself, yeah? Uh, yeah, is that for any purpose? Are you looking at it? Yeah, it's an investigation. Um, we've got... Um, do, you know the trust, do you know the trust pilot? Yeah. Score there, I'll show you. You see where it says 9.4 out of 10? Yeah. You don't have 10 on trust pilot, you only have five. Yeah. And then you've got the photos there of all the customers collecting the cars. And it's all like, why? Why have you got so many posters saying one thing when, does that, was that even taken here, that photo? Yeah, I'm not sure, to be honest, I need to, but, <clears throat> because we've got- I'll go and have a look. Yeah. I'll go and have a look. Yeah. I've got to find What's out. What's your name, sorry? Uh, DJ. DJ. So there we go, guys. We've um, asked a couple of questions about lots of posters saying lots of bold statements and implications of loads of customers collecting their cars from here. But were those photos taken here? And is the Trust Pilot score 9.4 out of 10, as it says over there, with five stars illuminated? Hmm over 100,000 customers can't be wrong color coordinated there so we're looking for a fence and a gate it's where the gate is higher than the blue fence so all we've got here is a blue wooden fence going all the way around it meets the grey fence over there which then turns into bushes and continues with the grey fence and returns to the blue wooden fence around here but they've got quite a lot of spare spaces down at the back and it's very well organised each vehicle has per week price let's get a bit closer so drive away in one hour 46 pound 51 per week with a 999 pound deposit or your old car as deposit and if you want to see some small print pause it there we've got lots of different examples per week 54 51 43 so they really are making it affordable that's for sure all identified by alphabetical order a b c d so there'll be some sort of inventory sheet hello you're right yeah is it like an inventory sheet sending the um we don't uh, do you mind if i ask what you're filming for sir i've told security yeah. i've told the lady on reception okay that's Who are one. you, sorry? I'm one of the managers, so... Oh, right. Okay, so that's what I'm asking, so... Yeah, yeah. okay. Uh, if you're the manager, I'll yeah. explain again for you. Yeah. Um, I'm making a video yeah. for my YouTube channel yeah. about anything I find interesting. Okay. And while I'm in Wensbury today, this place just stands out with all the signage you've got, okay. all the claims of probably, you know, probably the UK's cheapest cars. Okay. And the 9.4 out of 10. 
very good claims. I'm just coming to investigate to see if it's actually true. Do you know where this chap is? There's this camera walking around. Okay, so look. Um, and it, you could use it. As, as, as yeah, do you want to let the gentleman pass? You could use it or you could dismiss it. And I'm getting the inkling you want to dismiss it. Look, I've got to ask the superior, right? So, because normally you'd have to get permission from head office in order to film, etc. So, I don't know why the receptionist would have said that to you. But if you just bear with me a few minutes, I'll find out. Yeah, yeah, I'm just walking around, mate. I'll turn on them. Um... Oh, don't worry about it. Let's turn on the scanner to hear what they're saying on the radios. It'll be PMR, so there's no reason why we can't hear what they're saying. So a nice Volkswagen Golf here, blue motion, 101 pound per week. Very nice. Stacks and stacks of examples, isn't there? Hello? Hello? Hello, can I ask who gave you permission? I've already explained to three no, it's people right. now. I'm the operations manager. So okay. You can to me, Definitely please. the last time, yeah? Yeah. The last time, what? The last time I'm going to explain because I don't really want to be repeating myself. I'm, I'm, I'm Who's giving you permission now? Yeah, I'm just about to tell you. So I spoke to security upon entry to the site to tell him I'm here to make a video. I'm trust pilot and I still know everything is true. Yeah. Hold on, let me just listen to what they're saying. You're going to ask me to leave? Yeah. Even though I've had permission to, to be yeah. here? Yeah. So you're going to revoke my permission that I've just been granted by your reception? Sorry? Can you show me who gave you permission? Hold on, let me listen to what your friends are saying. Come on. And he just puts him on his YouTube channel, so I think that's why he's doing something similar. But he's like taking photos and he's got a video camera in his hand and he's just filming all the cars and stuff. Do you want me to say to stop filming? The receptionist. And security. Yeah, hey, listen, listen. Come on then. Listen, listen. Come on then. I'll go stand in front of him. I can hear you. Well then. He said I can do. He did. Listen. Don't shout at me, mate. Well, listen, do your job properly, man. They're saying, they're saying leave him alone, so who leave me alone. Who are you to tell me what to do in my job? Listen to the walkie-talkie. Don't have that attitude with me. You're trying to tell me. Don't have that attitude. I'll have the attitude with you if, if you're you? not listening. If you're right. not listening to your walkie-talkie. Why will you have an attitude? I'm a, do you treat all your customers like this? You're not this? a customer. Why just, not? Hang on. If I see something I like, I might want to buy it. How do you know? Operations director. I don't think you are. Are not? you really? Yeah. Operation. Is he an operations director? Yes, Talking to customers like that? Yeah, because of your attitude. You should have listened to what they were telling you your on the walkie-talkie. I, I heard it. You. Well, I heard it. Yeah, because you were rude and weren't talking to me. If a decision is being made on the walkie-talkie, you should it's listen to the decision. Yes, it is. I've just heard it. I don't okay, come okay. here to be told what to do by you. Okay. Listen to what your colleagues are you telling you. Listen to me. No. Right, so, so well, what's what's it, where you? does it say operations director? Where, where, I don't believe is, you. Is, is it, is well, I don't care. Is, is it is operations director. I don't care what you believe. What's your title? What's my title? Member of the public. Can I have more respect? What's your name, sir? DJ. DJ. Do you mind if I have a word with you, uh, Steve? I spoke to Ash, so I'll get you still there. Yeah. Okay, that's Thank fine. you. Okay. All right. So. I've told you all along, I'm, here, I'm making a video for okay, YouTube. That's, that's fine. This place looks very interesting. That's I've fine. just come to find out more. Any that's statements fine. that you're making about trust pilot scores, yep. I'm just going to look into it okay. and show the public the truth. If I can I'm going to yeah. show the public that you've got an amazing layout. Yeah, yeah. You do weekly payments. Yep. You can drive away in an hour. Yep. I'm saying good things, yep. but I'm also revealing things yep. that are not true. That's fine. Okay. Uh, members of the public can come and do this sort of thing. Um, but if yep. you embrace it, allow me to do it, yep. I'm also going to show them great things. Okay. When I get, is he really an operations director? He's, he's, an oper he's in operations, but I've spoken to uh, my, uh, uh, my manager. Is he, uh, the person you spoke to, was it higher than him? Uh, well, the thing is, he's he's the one who runs the site, but he's he's operation, so he deals to day to day running of the site, etc. So the gentleman that was just there, yep. is he going to make the overriding decision, it's gonna or be, not? It's the decision is going to be made by the the guy at the back. The which, which, is it above this guy here? The, they're in the similar position. Okay, okay. Okay. So I'm not going to get in dispute. What, what's with the them. decision? Okay, you can film. 
Okay, that's what I've been told, so I'm here to pass the message on. Thank you, thank okay. you, Akbar. That's okay. that's brilliant. Yeah, right. it's only going to take ten more minutes. Okay, that's fine. And then I'm going to take we, the drone I, over. The reason why I came to you because I didn't know who you were. You know I, I mean? told you, mate. You know, I know, but you told me at the time. But there was no prior warning for your arrival, etc. I spoke to two people before yeah. I've come in. But, but nothing was said on the radio. That's what I'm trying to say. That's yeah. not my fault, okay. and I don't expect an operations man, uh, operations director, okay. to treat people like that. But, but it's all okay now. Can I get an apology? Okay. Just for the video, because then we can put that to bed. Can we shake hands or not? You can do it, but. You, you Mate, have permission of anybody? I have. Two people I've spoke to. None of those people have got. They were right. telling you. They were telling you on the radio. If you listened, they haven't got the right to give you permission. Well, don't put them on the front of the house then. Well, For, they're, they're I, I go in there. I Hello. go in there and I tell people what Hello. I'm doing. Yeah, all right. That, it's that. At that point, they can say sorry. Yeah. We don't want you to. But they says yes. Go ahead. So I've come in and I've even tried to shake hands and put it to bed. And he's saying you don't have no right. You've not had permission. Yes, I have. Actually, I'm just going to leave it. I'm going. Okay. I, I don't feel like promoting your business and, and putting a good message out there. I tried my best, but not today, guys. All right. No, I'm not hanging on. Goodbye. If he now feels it's more important to take a phone call than to resolve that matter. Well, there we go. The Trade Centre UK. We tried our best. We came in with all the right intentions. Yeah, we have got some statements here that we wanted to look into. But... I am not even going to try and put this matter to bed. Let's just get out there, get the drone footage and move on. Thank you, mate. So we're now outside of this Trade Centre UK. We've checked on drone assist. There are no flight restrictions in this area. So let's get David up and see what this place looks like from above. And let's see if we can find that spot where that photo was taken from all those happy customers. Because it certainly wasn't at the back, was it? And it's not across the front here. So is that false advertising or was it done at another site? Or was it done down here. Let's just check the colour of the fence in. Down here. No. Nope. No blue fence in with a taller blue gate at all. And the section behind the fence also does not have any blue fence in. So that's why we can't find it. That's why none of the staff know where it is because it is not here. Right. So that's how big the place is. Undercover. That's how much space they've got at the front there. And I do believe they're also using this bit of land opposite for storage. It does actually say staff only, so these vehicles at the front are for the staff. And in the surrounding areas, a few more units, some houses, some green space areas, a school over there. And very well situated. Making some very nice claims and as you can see transporters in and out very often that one's collecting two four six eight nine vehicles yeah nine vehicles and it does say tradecentreuk.com on the livery the Trade Centre Wales as well, and they use Can Can Car Finance, Coventry, Wensbury, Rochdale, and Rotherham. So maybe this is some internal movement of vehicles from one site to the other, maybe. Certainly using every inch of the space. So I've just noticed the car park also extends down here. These do 
all have something in the windscreen so maybe that's where the transporters go to get loaded where maybe the vehicle has sold at a different site and they just need to do an internal transfer to get it there but let's get nice and high get the whole site in one shot do a 360 photo for Google Maps and then move on not the best experience this place for me and that concludes the video from here at the Trade Centre UK probably the UK's cheapest cars in the word probably but if you come and try and have a look into it and try and answer any questions that you might have and make a little video and they're not too keen are they they just want you to believe what they tell you we didn't get any of our questions answered or any explanation or any reasoning about why it might be talking about out of 10 you know why did they choose to talk about 10 when Trustpilot is all about five Anyway, the location of the DJ Audit's Key Ring is just in this little bush here. You can just about see the blue. Just there. So if you are one of the first people to watch this video, good luck with that. And I'm going to move on. So if you have enjoyed that video, do give it a thumbs up for me. And I'll see you on the next one, guys. Bye-bye for now. Yeah. What is it? You've got to tell me. Hmm? You've got to tell me. I've got to tell you. I yeah. don't know. You're the one who's doing we, YouTube. We, we do a competition where if, if the viewer sees me out filming yeah. and they tells me the channel name, they get a prize. I can't, I can't tell you the name. It's going to be a hard one though, isn't it? It's if you don't YouTube. watch it, you can't get a prize. We don't know who you are though. Oh, you no. don't? No. Oh, that, leave it as that. Best way. Because it's not gone very well, so you don't want to watch this one. It's not gone very well? No, no. All right, take care, guys.